on the west side of Manhattan, less than a mile away from the world's most famous arena, Carmelo Anthony found his summer escape. It was a basketball court at a gym on 42nd Street, a few hundred feet from the Hudson River. The court is tucked away from the prying eyes of the public, on a lower floor of Lifetime Athletic next to the Sky Building, one of the premier high-rises in the neighborhood. There was room for maybe a few dozen spectators, not the thousands that Mello played in front of at Madison Square Garden for six-plus seasons. There were no New York Knicks fans screaming at Anthony during his daily workouts the way they did during loss after loss late in his Knicks tenure. This was a place where Anthony could get away. No drama, just hoops. Knicks forward Lance Thomas worked out at the same gym as Anthony during the off-season. He begins his summer workouts a few weeks after the Knicks' final game, earlier than many of his NBA contemporaries, so he was surprised to see Anthony already in the gym in early May. When I saw Carmelo, I said to him, what are you doing here? Thomas recalls. This is where I need to be, Anthony said, a few weeks removed from one of the more challenging seasons of his NBA career. This is my happy place. Anthony who returns to message on Saturday night for the first time since being traded from the Knicks to the Oklahoma City Thunder, would spend five hours a day at the gym doing individual workouts, lifting weights and playing pickup. While Anthony was there, his representatives and Knicks management were trying to find a way to trade him out of New York. There was a buyout agreement in place that was vetoed by Knicks owner James Dolan. There were trades with the Houston Rockets that were close to fruition. There were talks between the Knicks and several other teams, including the Portland Trail Blazers. But nothing was finalized over the summer, so there was Anthony, Hoodie, and all, blocking out the noise as his Knicks career neared the finish line. Just locking into what I have to do and locking myself into the gym and locking myself into focusing in on my body, Anthony said during training camp this fall. Because I didn't know what was going to happen. It was just so much going on that was surrounding me that I just wanted to find a way that I could just focus in. Of course, he had to invite some friends over for some pickup. LeBron James, Kevin Durant, Chris Paul. Russell Westbrook, James Harden. CJ McCollum. D'Angelo Russell, Devin Booker, Victor Oladipo, and more. There was a lot of firepower in the gym, says Dante Jones who was a regular at Lifetime over the summer. It was like playing pickup with your friends, but your friends just happened to play in the NBA. On any given day, there could be nearly $200 million in 2016-17 to 17 salary on the court. And as you'd expect, the atmosphere was a bit more intense than your average 5-on-5. Five five. Every boat is still bringing their ego to the court and talking s. Cleveland Cavaliers and former Knicks guard, Junior Smith, said. Talking about who's got rings and who don't, who's an all-star and stuff like that, so it's fun.